So we've made several videos on this channel about the differences between Shopify and WooCommerce, and each platform has its own diehard supporters. But one thing that even WooCommerce supporters will admit is that everybody seems to love the Shopify checkout experience. It's fast, user-friendly, and perfectly optimized for high conversion rates. So everyone should just switch over to Shopify then, right? Problem solved. Well, there's no need to jump ship just yet if you're on WooCommerce, because you can enjoy the best of both worlds. In this video, I'll show you how to make your WooCommerce checkout just like Shopify's by using one of a few different plugins. This means that you can easily combine WooCommerce's cost effectiveness with Shopify's high converting checkout. Now, before I get into the how part of this video, I feel it's important to explain the why first and foremost. Let's talk about what makes the Shopify checkout page so special. Critical to every online transaction, the checkout is literally the final point where customers can decide whether to complete their purchase or abandon their cart. The best checkout experience focuses on making the process as easy, fast, and reliable as possible. And Shopify does this perfectly. It has a clean and user-friendly design in a two-column layout. As a customer, you can also expect multiple payment options that include credit cards, Apple Pay, Google Pay, and PayPal. Plus, the checkout is mobile-friendly, which will only become more important as more shoppers choose to use their mobile device for all of their e-commerce needs. Putting this all together makes Shopify's checkout page one of the best in the entire industry and worth replicating if possible. So now the moment you've been waiting for, here's how you can create a Shopify style checkout within WooCommerce. We have two options for this using professional plugins and they're both linked in the description below this video. The first option and the one I absolutely recommend for you is to use the WooCommerce FastCart plugin. As this plugin brings in the best of both worlds from both Shopify and WooCommerce to give your customers a fast and fluid checkout experience. FastCart not only optimizes the checkout page, it actually goes a step further by displaying the WooCommerce checkout in an on-page pop-up cart, with the benefit being that customers can complete their order from the same page where they clicked the add to cart button, which makes the whole process faster than the Shopify checkout. You can test out the plugin on a demo site by using the first link in the description below. And if you choose to purchase the plugin, it also comes with a 30 day money back guarantee. To install the plugin, download the files from your purchase confirmation email and take note of your license key. From your WordPress admin, go to plugins and click on add new plugin. Then click upload and choose the zip file that you just downloaded. Click install and then activate. Now this will launch the setup wizard where you can enter your license key and then click activate, which I've already done here, and then click on next. Now the setup wizard will walk you through a series of options that you have. So let's go through them one by one. Here in the layout options, we have a side cart or a centered pop-up option. I like the side cart as it resembles the Shopify checkout. You can also choose to enable the auto open feature, which will slide out the cart immediately after an item is added to the checkout, which also does resemble the Shopify experience in many cases. You can then add a floating cart. I like it at the bottom of the page. You can also choose another location. And for the button style, you can choose icon only, or you can add some text or icon plus text. Now, this is important. I recommend adding both steps to the fast cart. So both the cart and the checkout will be available in this pop out window from fast cart. You can also choose which features to include from the cart page. And another important step is you can completely replace the cart page and checkout page using FastCart. And if you want a very slick experience for your customers, I recommend doing this. And finally, we can finish the setup and go to the settings page. Now, after saving all of those settings, I can click on the FastCart pop-up and we can see immediately how it resembles the Shopify checkout experience. But with the added benefit of never having to leave the page that the shopper is on before they can go through the checkout. I also recommend playing around with the settings until you get a setup that works just right for your store. Now, the second plugin that I recommend using is Flux Checkout by Iconic. It's also easy to use and makes optimizing your checkout in WooCommerce a quick and simple operation. Just like FastCart, it completely replaces the default WooCommerce checkout. And in its place, you get a sleek, lightning fast and distraction free checkout. For starters, you can reduce the number of checkout fields. Plus, it removes all headers, footers and sidebars. 
so customers can focus on just checking out. It also replicates the much acclaimed two column layout that the default WooCommerce lacks. You can get started with Flux Checkout by using the second link in the description below. Then follow the same steps we did before to install and activate the plugin on your website. If you want to tinker around with the settings, then simply go to WooCommerce and find the Flux Checkout on your WordPress dashboard. There are many options like the style elements, which you can configure on this settings page here. You can also mess around with the header settings in case that's of interest to you. Then depending on how it's set up, it should look something like this on the front end. Of course, this will also be impacted by the theme that you're using. Now, before you go, I have five tips for you to optimize your checkout even further. Tip number one, if you have a multi-step checkout, streamline the process with a progress bar. My next tip is to find creative and non-pushy ways to offer more products to your customers. Tip number three is to always allow guest checkouts, although you still want to encourage people to sign up if you can. Then make sure you're offering multiple shipping and payment options. And remember to also display security and trust badges prominently to reassure users that their information is safe and secure. My final tip, is to set up abandoned cart recovery emails because they really do work. If you're curious to learn more about the differences between Shopify and WooCommerce, you can watch this video next. And to try a live demo of the FastCart plugin, you can click on this link here. And of course, thanks for watching.